so unbelievably offensive. Do you think that the curvature of the earth is supposed to be like this or something? Do you have no idea how big the earth is? Do you not understand that the curvature is not detectable at the surface of the earth? It's really well, but, but, big. It's a really big go over the horizon. We can see both huh? go over the horizon. We can see both go over the horizon, but we can't see the curve. Right? Dave, according to your math. Not everybody can be a robot polish shop. So I go after like anti-vaxxers. I also address misinformation. I'm very passionate about uh, public science literacy and science denial. He didn't know what gravity was. Einstein gave a better explanation. We're probably gonna get a better model later. We're probably gonna get a better model later. We're looking at light and we are understanding about the materials, right? We're understanding the composition of things based on light. We're understanding the composition of things based on light. We're understanding the composition of things based on light. Do you wanna learn something today? The things in the sky move. And do you know what spectroscopy is? No, 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 stop, 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 stop. <laughs> do you understand how vision works? No one yeah, sees I, I get it. in the sky. I, I know your talking points. So, and I'm here to tell you why everything you're saying is stupid. You look at the things in the sky to figure out the shape of the earth because that's how we figured it out 2000 years ago. I just proved the earth is a sphere multiple times in this exchange based on looking at things in the sky. I just finished proving the earth is a sphere by looking at stars. It's the easiest way to figure out the shape of the earth is by looking at the celestial ob objects in the sky. One of the easiest ways to know that the earth is a sphere because everything we see, everything including the earth, why stars, planets, moons, everything pretty much is spheres. Something that we've been doing for thousands of years. Right. Lights in the ceiling that determine the shape of the floor. I would like to get off of the lights in the sky because I'd rather talk about the shape of the earth. It's in the sky again, do not prove the shape of the earth. I want to move on from looking at the lights in the sky. As I prove the earth is a sphere by using that, that is no. that why you want to move on? No, not at all. Steve, the optics of the sky are no way to prove the shape of the earth. You can. You well, can... they are. Yeah, well. And I just did world. it twice. That's Dave, how we I... figured out the earth is a sphere two thousand, several thousand years ago. Say well, I do. just did prove they, it with they... that. So Dave. I don't know what to tell you. If you mm -hmm. understand what the flat earth model is, if somebody's in Santiago. You don't have a model. I in genuinely have no idea what you're like. What, what are you talking about? I have no I, idea what you're I, talking I, about. Already I, lost. I have no idea what you're saying. I'm not saying anything. I, so what thing. are you talking about? You're just I not saying tell, anything. I can. Works, you've never done any math in your entire life. And people who understand science can do calculations. Your entire existence is being a dick to hey. all of science. You have the intellect of a five-year-old. You can't understand, like... It's like the first thing we figured out. So hey, this is why it's so offensive. It's so offensive. It's so offensive. Because it is a denial of literally all of science. So unbelievably offensive. That's why you're a douchebag. The magnitude of douchebaggery that is your entire identity. Uh, you're no, a condescending no, douchebag. You, you're not getting it. Listen, you're not getting this. That's acceleration. Okay? So Ooh, big just words. This, just this acceleration is a big word. You have daylight. Daylight is the illumination of the sky. The sun is a, is lighting up the sky. It's like uh -huh. a photographer. You have your main light and then you have your backlight. The sky is the daylight. When the sun is on the east side of your house, right on the horizon, go to the back side of your house. You can read the newspaper. Well, where's that? That sunlight's not, what's it going through your house? It's lighting up the sky. So right. Light illuminates the things that it hits. Yeah. Want it to do the light to go around the moon and come back and no. hit the other side like magic yeah. and go that's a line and that's a line and if we're just looking at less than a mile yeah it looks really straight but it's not because hey. the earth is a sphere hey. so it's not because hey. the earth is a sphere hey. so it's not because the earth is a sphere what a fucking bitch am i right <laughs> not everybody can be a robot polish we're probably going to get a better model later we're understanding the composition of things based on light